we have to start because I got to go to a uh, basketball game. I got my shit. My man is committed to these basketball games, Bro. dog. He treats us like he gets paid. I do. Yo, you no, are never I get paid late. emotionally, son. <laughs> Real talk, you're like, yo, I cannot... But Cass is like, yeah. Cass like has meetings for the podcast. Yeah, yeah. And Andrew's like, yo, man, you got to move that shit. Because I got I got a pickup game Hurry up, where we wear jerseys. Yeah, I got, <laughs> I mean, there's refs, B. Yo, like, see, it's, a, it's a fucking professionals league. Son. It's a bunch of people making six figures. That's, who, that's a lot. Doing other things. Who yeah. are like, let's play basketball for yeah. fun. No, absolutely. It's adult recess. It's adult recess. You're, everything that, that you're saying is I know, I know. Right. And, I, and it's the most important part of my week. But, well, listen, to your point. The most important part of my week. To your point. Yeah. What do kids look forward to in school? Recess. It's the only time they don't want to cut down. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I, yeah. This is what I have. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. This is my outlet. There's one thing that I get to do throughout the week yeah, that isn't man. you know work-related. It, it, I get a release. I just want to let you know, I'm leaving early, not so I could make the game just barely. So I could get my stretches, stretches in, so I could run around the gym, <laughs> so I could do layup lines. I want to put up at least 50 shots from different parts of the of the court. Like, uh, I, I hoard a basketball. I bring my own basketball. My basketball's in my bag right there. You don't shoot with anybody? I, first of all, I get my dribbles in. I got to get my dribbles in. I don't. I try to not you shoot really You really Steph Curry this. Bro, I don't play. If it was up to me, they wouldn't touch my basketball. But I reluctantly pass them if I miss and the whole thing. But I need repetition constantly right, to right, stay right. in the game. Right. So that's why I'm going to do it. Listen. This is very important to me. What do you have outside of this? You have you have what do you, you have stand up, obviously. Yeah, yeah. You have um fighting with your girlfriend. You have That's a good one. Yeah. And calling and talking to your mom on the phone. My mom doesn't call me. So I have <laughs> basketball. You know what I mean? Yeah, my mom Not calls me everyone. every day. And it's gotten to the point where if she doesn't call me, I'm like, who the fuck did she yeah, think did she my mom is? Die? <laughs> you know, I, I get worried. And then but, I call her like, I was worried sick about you. Son, when my mom texts me, I get worried sick. <laughs> the first thing I think is, what happened to dad? <laughs> is dad okay? Everything's going with dad? <laughs> I literally got a text. It was touching right now. My mom just texted me. I, I didn't even read the whole one. What a piece of shit I am. We have not seen you in a long time. We miss you. Any chance of getting together soon? We understand you're terribly busy, so don't feel guilty. We love you and miss you, mom and dad. Oh, that that's shit was beautiful. That's amazing, bro. man. That's amazing. No, that Alex called beautiful. over from the from the from the computer. You sound like a shitty ass son. Yo, this is I'm, white people, though, I'm man. I'm calling I, my mom. Right white now, people's right. relationship with their put her on speaker. His I, mom is it's hysterical. It's not only because Italians and like Jews, they have like a really special relationship. You know what I mean? But like Scottish moms, they're a little different. Mom. I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. All of a sudden, my phone's working. Well, it listen, wasn't working yesterday. Mm -hmm. it, it was. It wasn't working yesterday. Well, look, I'm I'm recording the, the sports podcast right now, and the guys were they were ripping me because they said I wasn't being a good son and I was neglecting you guys. And I just want to tell you I love you and and you oh. you inspire me and I think that you're amazing and I wish that you called me more. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mrs. Cameron. This is Akash, by the way. Mom? She hung up on you, dog. Well, that's, <laughs> that's my relationship with my mom. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. our relationship in a nutshell yeah, right she there. She hung up on you, fam. Oh, my God. She's like, oh, my God. <laughs> Listen, yeah. if I'm ever hard on these yeah. hoes, y'all know why. <laughs> it ain't my fault. Oh, that's the right? thing he's ever said. That's the realest thing he's ever said. God damn. Oh, my God. I tried, Ma. I tried. Oh, my God. I hope you're oh all right, Ma. God. You know, my mom's phone probably on 1%. Look at me making excuses for it. <laughs> She's like, sorry, son. was just re-watching the news. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> did you say rewatching? <laughs> yeah, we saw it, but I wanted to see it again because uh, that was more interesting than talking to you about your podcast. Oh, man. <laughs> my mom, you read my, my mom literally. Like your mom calls me more than my mom calls <laughs> Yo, my mom is kind of tight at you. Got... She sent you a Christmas text, didn't get a text back, and she was like, I don't know son, what I did to Andrew. Son, son you want to know some real shit? Yeah. I got your mom's text. Right. No, this I, there's a reason for this. You a shitty son to two moms. No, no, there's a reason for this. There's a reason for it. It's me. <laughs> <laughs> it's really me. It's, I'm glad you got fucked in the ass on there's John. <laughs> <laughs> I paid for it. Yo. So, look, th there's a... There's a, no, there's something, there was something exactly that happened. No, I was having like a really bad Christmas day. Really? It was like a dark, dark Christmas day. Mm. And I don't think I was responding to anybody. And like, I didn't even get my family gifts and shit. Like I came back the next day and it was better. And I, and I, you know, but it was 
dark and it was and I remember getting her text and I didn't know the number because I didn't have your mom's phone saved. Okay, problem number one. Um, can't be putting your mom's name in my phone, son. That's disrespectful. It's not. I'm supposed to put her in with all the other shorties, bro. Is your mom in your phone book? No. <laughs> <laughs> How am I disrespecting my mom? I put it in as Larry's piece. <laughs> your your ex is in my phone, still in my phone as Andrew's wifey. I should I'm just sorry delete it at this that. point. Yeah, <laughs> just delete it at this point. But uh, but no, no. In all seriousness, fuck. What was your mom? What's what? Uh, I can't tell you the exact number, but it's yeah, a four, man, six, I felt nine. bad about that. Is it what? It's four six nine area. So four six nine. Yeah, I know. I know. Fuck, man, I feel bad about that. I'm sorry. She I'm was sorry. she was sad. I know, but I'm, usually I'm. Tell me I was I'm like, not. I was like, I'll talk to him. She's like, no, don't. Tell me I'm not, oh my God. But look, I usually, what did I she usually say? am texting. What did text, she say? Read the message. She said, wish you a very happy new year. But she also wished me a happy Christmas and I didn't respond. I'm calling she, her. She texted you on I'm New Year's, dog? I'm calling What's her. What's going on? Put I'm this on speaker. Her, Put I'm this on speaker. Her, I'm calling her. I'm calling her. How you say mom again in Hindi? Amma. Amma. Yeah. That's how we say it, at least. Um, um, uh, hey, this is Andrew. I'm doing a podcast right now with your, your son, Akash. And um, I just wanted to call and say I'm incredibly sorry for not getting back to you. That is so disrespectful and so rude. I apologize. Yeah, no. What? Say that again? Yeah, I just I'm so sorry. I was having a really bad Christmas. I was I was feeling pretty down, I think, on Christmas, and I think that's why I didn't get back to you. Now New Year's I have no excuse. So <laughs> I'm sorry about that. But but I, I really no. I I'm really so grateful that you reached out. Thank you so much. I'm so sorry about that. Oh you're welcome. And have good stuff in life and you are the best person my son can be around. We have a family and I'm very happy highly of you. Oh so, uh, that's oh, really that's really nice. Okay. He was just making fun of me for uh, a homosexual scene in a <laughs> TV show that I did. But I do trust that what he says to you is true. I do. <laughs> no, he has a lot of, um, he brags about your life. I do. Oh, I do. Well, just know I do the exact same about him when he's not around. Never to his face. I would yeah. never give him that glory. Yeah. But um, when You're not supposed not... to tell him. I'm a... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, anyway, I just wanted to say thank you so much. I love you thank and I hope everything's you. good. Okay? Love you, Amma. See, man, that's beautiful right there. That's minority oh, moms right there. That's right. My mom just texted me back. Yo, fam, busy. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, oh, this is my mom. Text me. You tell your friends you are a great son and have always been. Thanks for the call. It made me feel so warm inside and full of love for you. Aww. God, moms, dog, Yo, moms are the best, best man. Son. Yo, yeah, moms are the best, bro. Yo. Yo, this is the difference between moms and women. I've been saying this. <laughs> I have a bit about this. Do you? Yeah, I what say. I'm not. Listen, moms are to be. We talked about this bit. I haven't worked it out, but like moms are. I put moms on a pedestal. Right. They're not even human beings. They're angels walking the earth. Mm-hmm. Women's who haven't had kids are yeah. just us. Right, they're just, just guys. me. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't, I don't respect me. I'm gonna respect you. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's a big workaround. But it is beautiful. Oh, thank you, mom. Oh, thank you, mom. Mom's the best, most selfless, angelic creatures God ever created. All right, I love you. Yo, text really improved our relationship. <laughs> For real, it did. It really did. Now we be texting all the time. Look at that <laughs> <shit>. <laughs> My mom just learned that she didn't have to like sign the text. <laughs> like she used to write the whole text and be like, "Mom." <laughs> like she was worried, like when it got thrown out to text land, like someone else it could go. <laughs> Yo, we gotta, we gotta do a Mother's Day episode with all yes! the moms. I've talked about this. Get the moms Bring all in. the moms on, and mom sports opinions are always the funniest. Oh God, that'd be great. I yeah. remember I was rooting. I I never rooted for Kobe. I always hated Kobe. Mm-hmm. Now, obviously, I respect him, but I couldn't root for the Lakers. Sure. So I was watching the finals: Sixers, Lakers. And I'm rooting for the Sixers. And my mom is like trying to be supportive. And she's saying things like, Shaq is too big. He's cheating. And like that's the only opinion she has. He's too big. He's cheating. He's cheating. He shouldn't be that big. And I was like, this is adorable. I would have kicked her out the room so fast. Yo, I mean, yo yeah. stop ruining the game, well, mom. I want to, but it's just so adorable. She's just sitting there, nah, four foot eleven, just looking. No, nah, moms are special. Moms are special people. I remember hearing like, maybe we'll save this for like when... When our moms come on, but I remember asking my mom, like, what was it like when she just had me? Like, you know, when you're a kid, like, what was it like? And uh, 
she was like, well, you know, um, I hired a babysitter and, um, but I didn't trust her (laughs) 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 because one day I came home and you had, you had a wee, wee rash on your, on your, uh, on your arse, right? (laughs) I go, I had, a, I had a what? I had a rash on my ass. She said, we rash on us. I didn't trust the babysitter. So one day she took you to the park and I followed her. <laughs> I, follow, I followed her to the park and I, and I hid behind a bush watching all the kids in the park. And I understand now how crazy that sounds. <laughs> Just a wee Scottish lady staring at kids from behind a bush. But I needed to make sure that she wasn't hurting my baby. <laughs> and I think I figured out what she was doing. This 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 babysitter, she would just she would just put you in the she would just put you in the swing, and she wouldn't have swing you. <laughs> she would just leave you there. She'd leave you in the swing, Andrew. That's, that's criminal. You should bro, be locked up for that. Bro, for real, that's I was a like, fucking criminal. That's offense. why you had the rash on your arms because you were sitting in the wee <laughs> swing for hours. You were sitting there for hours, Andrew. As my knees were getting tired when I was watching you from the bush. I go, I go, Mom, why'd you leave me there for hours? You could have stepped in, like, could have stepped in after, like, 30 minutes. Like, yeah, why don't you get a, the kid a push on the swing? She was like, she's like, I did think about that, Andre. But there's parts of me that wanted to know how long she would have left you there in the swing. And I couldn't believe it. It was hours you were in the swing. Oh, man. Yeah. Yo, I love you, mom. Your mom, your mom sounds a hell of like Conor McGregor. <laughs> <laughs> Can't help but notice that. <laughs>